How's it? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everybody. 早上好，下午好，晚晚上好。OK， 呃、uh, ，Let's 新年快乐，新年快乐。Yeah, it's it's a, it's a、uh, Chinese New Year Eve today. Ah,、uh, let me do a little bit of review of、uh, from last class. Like this four.、Uh, let me see if I can make this bigger. Can you see my cursor move? Yes. Okay. 上上下木 all four stone. So when you put them together, even though you put them to,、uh, together, it doesn't make sense. But you just practice the pronunciation. Three character together. They all go the same direction. Oh oh oh. 上下木 Then you wouldn't go 上下木 or 上下木 No. 上下木 the same pattern. So. Try to memorize that pattern in your mind.、Mm, yeah, really? Oh, oh, 上下木 Yeah, use your hand to help、uh, to build up this connection of tone. It takes some time. It takes some time for for uh, uh, non-Chinese speakers, even like um, uh, like Asian people, like ja- Japanese or Korean、uh, people. They have the same. Because this、uh, pronunciation habit has nothing to do with your Western or or Easterner, yeah. That's a, just a, a a habit you need to build up at the beginning. So the first three months we are, we are kind of move slower. We build up a very good foundation for pronunciation and recognize the character, connecting the the picture with the sound, with the tone, and the meaning in your mind. You establish this kind of way of thinking. That's critical. And、then we can move faster and faster. Okay. Uh, uh, 新年好 like a 新年好新年快乐 right? 日月星 the same thing. The fourth tone. 日月星天地恩二呀天地人啊要要要呃 practice for 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 fun. Don't take it as a yeah yeah. Don't take it as a burden, okay? Treat it as oh, pretty for fun. If you if practice and feel a little tired, drop it, forget it. Yeah, just a couple of seconds, ten seconds, do a few times, and then forget it, and do whatever you're doing. Then you have a ten seconds、uh, spare time, then you you practice again, repeat it many times, but just re- use the very little time. Don't do it like one hour. That that will get you very tired. It's not. It's not、um, a good way to do it. Just use a little fraction of your time. Do it, and then repeat again, and just trying to remind you the tone. When you when you are not sure about the tone, go back to the、uh, yeah, really, oh, oh, that's four tone, right? Okay, this character mu can、uh, if we translate could be two mi- two meaning. Original meaning is tree. Tree meaning is alive. It can grow, can bloom. Have flower can have uh, uh, like apple. You can,、uh, apple tree have apple, peach tree have peach, pear tree have a pear. It can grow. It can produce. That's the original meaning, fundamental meaning. And the second meaning, second layer, is a general wood, just like、uh, in、uh, in English, woods. Woods could be alive. Could be just you know you cut it and then put it there, like like a by a firing wood. Uh, has both meaning depends the context, but original meaning, fundamental meaning is 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 tree, has the meaning common meaning embedded meaning as grow, live. Okay. Okay. Then move. Then we get we get on to today's and the other three character first. Then we move on. You you can see my cursor, right? Yes. Yeah. This is a mountain. See, Shan. Shan. Good. The first Shan. one. Shan. 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 This is easy, Shan. right? Yeah. Yeah. Shan. Yeah. You just remember this is four vertical sh- strokes, symbolize the peak of the mountain, right? Now this one is water, because if you go go out for a walk or you have a picnic, that's the very easy to see. Is every everywhere to see is mountain. And water, or pond, or lake, 
or river or big river or whatever. So these two things in nature, in mother nature, is very easy to see. Thing. So we usually usually put them together. San shui, this uh, pronounced as shop shui. Yeah, good, good. Yeah, yeah. For some of you, like, uh, like, like, like see this, uh, this SH. This SH. Shang, shang, the, the first two things is the same thing, like a shop or sheep. Sheep. Shui. Good. I, I, I hear Jack. Very good. Shui. Shui. Okay. That's water. Yeah, flow. But it's very interesting. You see the flow in the center is continued stroke. On the side is discontinued. And if you if you symbolize that as a stroke, if you if you if you, if you make this turn 90 degree, could be like this. So that's uh, uh, one symbol of a bagua. In the cen center, this one, center, is a yang, yang symbol. And this is yin symbol. The whole character water is actually uh, symbolizing uh, soft, flexible. You, know, you, you, you put water in any container. You put it into the, the, uh, uh, in a, in a square one, it's going to be square. You put in a, um, like a bowl, it's going to be wrong. Yeah, it, it changed according to the situation. So that's the very uh, fundamental character of yin, yin side. So that's how female is soft, gentle, tender, gentle, s s flexible. So that's the quality of uh, yin side. But inside, but for this character, you see the end center, that's a yang. That's the, the water always flowing. So there's always a force. So that's the yang side. So there's a, and I'm introduce another concept for you. There's yang inside the yin. Always, there's also yin inside the yang. If a man has to be strong, but has to have the gentle side. You know, women or female has to, in general, is flexible, is gentle, is soft, but she's also inside, has something strong to hold it, balance. Yeah, balance. That's that's the that's that's why war inside is solid inside this stro stroke. Shui, 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 great. And this one is walking. We we showed last time, right? This is actually the fast walking. It's not a regular, very casual. Very casual is different character. This, this is almost running, but uh, in, in, in the Chinese character. Running has another, another, another character. There's running big pace and fast walking. So that's the original meaning you see here, right? The third character, uh, pronounced as zhao, zhao, zi, like you, 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 yeah, you listen to me. Uh, uh, you all, you, everybody has experience, uh, heard that, uh, uh, that, that noise. Like uh, electricity, same. You can close your teeth. It's not a chow. A chow is in it. Good. Good. Okay. And then we come here to here. Shan. Shan, 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 Zhao, Zhao, When you forget about, you just think about Zhao, Zhao, Good, Zhao, Zhao, Good, Good, And the the pian pang, the pian pang for this Zhao is pian pang, pian pang, pian pang is like this. It's going like this. So whenever there is a pian pang like this. It's connected the meaning to the walking 
or moving. Yeah, this this pin pound three three drop is the pin pound for for water. It's a radical. Remember, pin pound is a radical, right? Just a very simple part. Uh, anything, any we'll learn more and more character with this pin pound with this like, radical. When you see this pin pound, you know immediately know it's something related to water. Is or ocean or lake or pond or river or bigger river or a brook anything. Anything related to water, we will we'll have this pen pong. And we remember, we, we learned other pen pong before, right? Yeah. yeah. This Shen. is related to heart. heart. Anything related to thinking, emotion, sentiment, anything related to your, 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 your mind or your heart has this pen pong. Yeah, later on, we, 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 when we we accumulate more and more of this pian pong and also single character when we combine them together your vocabulary your vocabulary is going to be like double triple quadruple ten times yeah and then and at that stage you're going to get into 2000 very fast but before that we spend like half a year maybe even one year to build up this thing foundation that you take off right Okay, uh, now here is, uh, that, that's all for the uh, character, right? For today's assignment, you go practice writing and pronounce these three characters. Or, uh, when you have time, just uh, practice whatever we learned before. Just like I said at the beginning, take a 10 seconds, 20 seconds, practice one or two, three or two character, and forget it. And when you have some time, you know, think about other things, or you want to see something we learned before, and then you practice it, and then forget it, yeah. You don't need to spend uh, like uh, hours uh, practicing three characters. No, ten seconds would be good enough. The idea is do it repeated more times with a very f small fraction of time. Just use your spare fraction of time to do that. Okay. All right. Uh, now we we'll move on to the thing. <clears throat> Remember, we said uh, the very, very simple form character called the when. The complicated when, uh, yeah, it's when. called a, yeah, uh, and the complicated word zi. 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 like a, zi. the same thing, zi. Zi. Like, yeah, zi. Zi. yeah, yeah, like zi. like the, like like this one, like zao z z yeah zao, and this zi. one pronounced as a uh, zi. Zi, good, zi, good, good. Yeah, the simple, simple form uh, radical uh, called when you see this stroke, put them together, then make it more complicated called zi. Yeah, we learned this, we learned this, we learned this, 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 right? We didn't, it's okay, we'll come back, uh, come back to that later. This is a move we learned. So see, or anything with this move, is a kind of tree, this palm tree. This is peach tree. With this moon, when combined, upper side is moon, this is palm tree, this is a peach tree, this is, I think, uh, what's the English of this? Uh, this is a poplar, poplar tree. So at, at least you, you can guess. Guess is a very, very, very original primary gift. For, created for, for for human being to guess to guess in the right way so you see you don't know these characters but uh, you know this is something related to tree move here so at least you know this is a tree a certain kind of tree right this uh, called me and it uh, symbolizes the roof or uh, or a space so anything with this character see the, with this uh, when you don't know what it is, but there's a definite uh, something related to space. Yu, uh, yu, yu means the uh, space. Zhou means time. Yu zhou together means the universe. So universe in Chinese put together means time and space. Okay, uh, there's always there are space. And this is a home, jia, we get into that. This is a treasure. You always store your treasure under a roof or even under the ground, but uh, there is a roof there. So you see the roof here, you know there's something with this structure. And this is Ren, right? Human, a character, a uh, 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 for this is like that. All of this character related to human. 
This is Ren means compassion. We'll get into that. That or or kindness. This is Xiu repair. Higher meaning of the Xiu means cultivate. Uh, we'll get into that later. This is take a rest. Uh, always relate. At least you know something related to a human human behavior, human status. And this is the water, Shui, Shui with the radical uh, like this, with a uh, wind, like a uh, pian pang like this. This is a water, a big water, or a small water. This is a lake, this is the ocean. You don't know this, but uh, at least you see the, uh, the pian pang here, you know that's something related to water. We'll get into that more and more later, okay? This is just give you a heads up, okay? Makes sense, right? Okay? All right? Yes. So imagination is a critical gift. You, you want to use it. You don't want to give it up. Usually kids, young people have a better imagination. It's not they are better because they, they are not contaminated. They, they are not uh, formed too many other concepts, notions yet. So like somebody like uh, Jack and the tires, if you think something interesting, Something in your mind, if it's beautiful, it's good, it's kind. Don't feel, don't feel weird or bad. It's a good, it's a gift, okay? It's very, uh, what I want to say is for, uh, for adults, you want to go back to have that or come back again. Because we're living in the world for 20, 30, 40, 50 years, and then when we get used to all this con the notion in the society, and then we forget about the gift. Imagination is very important. For artists, for, for the, the best, the greatest scientists, for any occupation, if you are on top, you have to, you have, to have a very good imagination. Uh, you want to, uh, what I want to make a point here is that you want to Im imagine this as a tree. You want to show you the character, imagine this as a roof. Imagine this as a, somebody with a human, imagine something, something related to water. You, you see all this have the impression, right? Now let me show you this thing. Stroke, tree. But if you, I give you the picture, that will help you to understand, but also limit, limit your imagination. So that's a double, double side, double side swap, swore. If you feel that like this help you, it's good. But uh, eventually you, wa you want to give this up because human could be this form, could be this form, could be any form, but it's a human. So this picture give you, an, uh, 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 give you a picture, give me an impression, help you to understand, oh, this is connected. But also at the same time could li limit your imagination. That makes sense? I, I will utilize some of the picture to help you understand. But if you can imagine from the uh, a character, original character, moving uh, the evolved way, that would be better. Water, see? But this is the water, right? It's moving. Can you see this? Yeah. The water is flowing. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So picture is a good thing. Any tool is helpful. But if you rely on it, it could be a limitation. So there's a double-sided thing. Okay. The principle we introduced in uh, our in our in our lesson see so this is a Tao this is a Tao this is a Tao this is a Tao this is a principle for you to understand how the Chinese character formed and also to understand some of the uh, some of the meaning but uh, we don't need to uh, at, at least for this at this stage we don't need to go too deep dig too deep right you don't need to spend too much time on that Later on, later, later things come to you, right? We're, we're studying and we're thinking that's good. But uh, at the same time, you let the knowledge put together itself and come to you, okay? Just like you're driving. You, 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 ha you have a direction, you know where to go, but let, let the things come to you, the sceneries come to you at the same time, all right? Wen zi, okay, that's uh, the single one is called wen. The complicated, the complex one is called a zi. And this is for heads up. This is for next time's assignment. But uh, we have a heads up here, wen zi. So we'll pave some foundation for, for the later stage. Now, uh, 
So assignments for this period is San Sui and Zhou, three characters, right? That's okay. Well, getting we talked about the imaging or pictogram, and the second part is called indicating or implying the inner meaning. In Chinese, called a Xiang Yi, Xiang Yi or Hui Yi. Uh, you don't need to. You just. Uh, I'm going to repeat again, and again. You you just build up impression, right? Xiang Yi or Hui. Xiang Yi. Xiang Yi, right? This is a uh, this is an elephant. Remember? Xiang. You guys still remember? This is a, this is an elephant. Yes. Xiang. Xiang. Yeah. Then develop like that. Xiang Yi. Yi yeah. means meaning, inner meaning, or meaning, inner meaning. Okay, this is another uh, perspective of uh, of Chinese character. We're talking about this. For example, you don't know what the character, this character, is talking about. It's originally come from here. What what this mean to you? The first impression. It's a mother holding a baby, or or aunt holding a baby. Anyway, she's she's yeah, yeah uh, adult holding the baby. What this mean to you? this developed to be a character like this, and involved eventually to be like this. What's the meaning for you? Immediate impression. Caring for. Nurture. Care. Yeah. Hold. Care. Careful. Care. Take care. Protect. Right. Holding the baby. That's exact the meaning of this character. Pronounced as Bao, but. Uh, it means care, taking care, protect, hold. Yeah. So, yeah, you see, yeah. This is the head, head, then this is the head, this is the arm, this is the body, this is the leg, and there's another. So, this is a, 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 a pian pang, right? Mm -hmm. So, this character has something to, the meaning definitely has something to do with a human. And this one is a human too. So, yeah, and then you can you can take a guess. Okay, oh, okay. There's at least you know this character is something related to human behavior. And there's two human here. This this is a human. This is another human. So you see her. Right. Bao. That's uh, that's uh, uh, example for for impl for xiang yi or hui yi, just hui. symbolizing the meaning. So this is not a, a very simple picture that has a meaning. Care, protect. There's a deeper meaning. Does it make sense? Yes. Makes sense. I okay. Give you another example. This was uh, look, can, can, can origin. Yeah, as a fourth tone. Can is that like, can? Yeah, you you see that this is a this part is a at the palm, five finger one two three four five and this is arm, and this part is a, is a eye. And symbolize like this. Can means like this. Eh? Is the monkey king? Wow. Right, that's the can. Uh -huh. You look doesn't mean you see it. So this character mean, uh, means uh, pronounced as jian is a uh, you see it. See, there's a big eye here, uh -huh. and there's a, a human underneath. You, you see that the human here, right? You can see it clearly, right? The underneath part. The, this part. Is a standing human, but the big eye over here. So the emphasize your your eye. So you look for it, but you you do not necessarily see it. This one means you see it. I see you, see you. That's the first layer mean of this character pronounced as Jian. But uh, that's not that's not a that's not it. Because this human underneath here, there's a head. You see the head here, the head. He or she doesn't have uh, definitely has two two eyes, but why you ha you need to emphasize this eye here? Besides emphasize, you see it, you saw it, you have seen it. The second layer of meaning is here, this eye, big eye. So this eye can see higher, bigger, broader, see different things that this eye cannot see. So this this is actually the second layer of meaning of this gen. I, I look, I see it, and also I see the I see it over there too. So that's the meaning of jian, kan jian. So that's how pure insight is called zheng jian. Pure insight. Zheng jian. Yeah, zheng jian. This jian has that meaning there. At least the the the, the very 
very uh, shallow, very superficial meaning has that one. Jian, so that's Jian. This, go, this is Jian. Yeah, you see the eye, right? Big eye. Then transform it like this and written like this. Under this part is a human. You look and you see it and you also, also see it over here. Big eye. When you have a big eye, everything looks very small. You know that, right? Okay, cool. Uh, that's another example for, for Xiang Yi. For Xiang Yi, okay. Wen Zi, I give you the, uh, to show you how it evolved. Wen is also human, see? Human, uh, here. Standing, but there's something in, in is a symbol here. There's different layer of meaning. Could be symbolizing heart. See this inside of the heart here. Could be heart, and also uh, it it is said when 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 a person is very happy, there's a light could come out from here. Glowing. It's not just here. It's here is glowing. So that's the original meaning of this. If your heart is good, you're happy. It's positive. You come out of good light coming out from here, because inside that's your heart and all, all our spirit inside here. That's the, uh, basically how this character look like. Si means, you know, so there's a roof, it's a home, there's a house, the little baby. Uh, any home or any house has a baby, more and more baby, that means this family is growing. So that's the complicated or uh, 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 develop from single to more and more and more from here. So that's uh, the basic meaning of zi is have a baby in the house. But uh, it's uh, extended the meaning to, to, uh, to express the, um, to describe the character, uh, writing character. It's the single, very simple form to more complicated, more developed, you know, com combined, because your family is getting more and more and more and bigger. So, so that's the baby here. Okay, there's a little baby, right? Head, hand, body, and legs. Okay. Uh, that's when I think that's all. Okay, now here, here is a today's a repeat of today's uh, assignment. Shan Shui Zhao, mountain, water, and uh, big walk, right? Okay, any question? Any question from uh, uh, previous period or from today or whatever you, you, you think you want to you wanna ask? Go ahead, Ross. I just wanted to ask um, the character Mu in Mu Di. Is that like life's purpose? The Mu. That is a tree pronounced as Mu, right? When Kan Jian, the Jian, written like this, the upper part also pronounced as Mu. That's the Mu Di. Mu put together, that's the Mu Di. That's your target, your purpose. Okay. Okay. You want to see that place, then you want to go there. That's your Mu Di. You want to go somewhere, you have to see it, or at least you have to see it in here. Like you, 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 you plan in your mind. I want to go to New York, from Boston, New York. I want to drive 240 miles south. It uh, is a, a, a kind of, in a way, you have to see it in your mind or imagine in your mind. You want to go there. You know where to go. That's the move. So you can, kind of have to see in a certain extent. That's the mu di. That's the uh, purpose or target. Yeah. Gee. Um I don't completely understand. You said when is simple and zi is complicated, but I don't understand that quite. Okay. This is simple. And when you put two things together, it's complicated. And this is more complicated. Um. Like for example, the zi, the character zi. This means a roof. This has a, uh, this is a uh, simple form. This is pronounced as mian. Symbolize a roof, symbolize a house, or symbolize a big space. And this is another simple means baby, pronounced as zi. When you put these two things together, it's complicated. 
uh, make another one called zi. Or this plus this means jia, this part. It's another character called, pronounced as shi. Uh, and meaning, original meaning is pig. So it's very interesting why there's a house when you have a pig or a piggy, and that, that's the, the, the form of the meaning of a ha, ha, home or house. Mm -hmm. Think about that. Thank you. Yeah, think about why. Why? Yes, yeah. Yeah, sure. Yeah, that's also what you mean. It's a sun, it's a moon. Together, it's in daytime, this part is glowing. Nighttime, it's glowing. Put together, it's bright. It's light. It's brilliant. Oh, it's beautiful. This is the basic meaning of this character. Me, yeah. Uh, uh, Diana, I think you, you raised, or somebody raised a hand? No? I have a question. No? If uh, no one else, I have a question. Yeah, yeah, right. Uh, about the when from the. It's related to the Jean question. She asked about the zi. So I'm not sure the when. How how did it create from? I didn't understood the why it's like that. Oh, this one is a when. When yeah. Okay. Yeah. Origin is like this. It, it, it's symbol as a human. A head, hand, arm, body, leg, heart. But they took the heart out. <laughs> yeah. So that's how. From the very beginning, you have heart. Now they de developed and deviated, deviated, and they took the heart out. So they, they, they took the heart out like this. It's not only the Communist Party. Everyone did that. <laughs> yeah. Like Zen, we said Zen, originally written like this, it's very humble. You know, head is down, your, your hand is down. Now it's like uh, if you if you write it as a as a radical, it's like it's like this. So proud, <laughs> too arrogant, right? It the whole thing is mm, declining. So this thing is also declining. So it's all it's all together. But uh, it it doesn't matter. But we we still can use it nice to learn you know more cultural everything whatever we were to learn we can use this as a tool. Yeah. You have a very good, like for your thing, like there's another character. Uh, when you're talking about a character, I love. This is the original form. Now, you see the heart. This is a heart. Heart is gone. Nowadays, people are talking about love, they don't have a heart. <laughs> but originally, they really have heart there, right? It's the same thing like a, like a one. Uh, usually have a here, something here, then it become like this. Yeah, the same thing. Everything's changing, declining, deviating, but that doesn't matter. Uh, we know original form is like this, and we understand this. We can read from by utilizing, uh, understand all this character and read a book. Okay. Anything else? Thank you. Yeah, I have. A, I have a question. I have one um, number that is missing. Yeah. Uh, zero. Zero. Okay. Zero is missing. Writing part is complicated, so that's why I, I didn't do that. Okay. Uh, so it's written like this. It's a too complicated. This is the one character, simple character. This is another character. And this one can dissect it to the original form. Well, we'll come, come back to that later. It's more complicated because zero means nothing and also means everything. Everything. That's right. Yeah. So that's how we have this. We'll come back to that later. Mm -hmm. So we, we, you, you, you just need to practice from one to 9,909. Anytime you do, do uh, how to say that? Jiu 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 Okay. What about this? What about this? 
grade 三百六十八。Yeah, you just uh, come randomly come up a、uh, come up,、uh, the number and、uh, well, how to say that in Chinese and try to try to make the tune correct. Then for five seconds you forget about it. Then you do something. Then you, when when you see something, you see the English or or or, or your language is Hebrew thing. You see the number. Okay, how to say that in Chinese? How to say that?、And、we learn more and more. You practice for ten seconds. And you forget it. Just utilize the fraction of your time to do this. That will be more effective, and for fun. Yeah, and then forget you. You you pick up your、uh, dictionary to do that.、Uh, you don't need to spend hours. Yeah,、uh, you know, you know, don't. Try to build up the good habit. Any time you can write on your hands and practice your mind or say to others. Then ten seconds later, you do you do your other things. Yeah. All right. Anything else? No more question. Okay. Now that's all for today.、Uh, have a happy Chinese New Year, New Year, and see you next week. 新年好，好，谢谢大家，谢谢，新年快乐，新年好，再见，新年快乐，再见，新年快乐，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，再见，